I'm Jeff Alpin, the big game hunter. I'm the head coach for job search coaching hq.com and no BS coaching advice.com. This is a video that it doesn't really matter whether you're thinking about this from the standpoint of being a business owner or a job hunter or a friend or whomever. People make mistakes with their networking. And I'm going to do a series that is going to address some of the things that people mistakenly do that adversely impacts the success of networking and causes them to go, ah, networking doesn't work, it's ridiculous. So mistake number one is you do everything online and never talk to anyone. Now, I know the trend really started with email in a very profound way, but you know, people used to write letters to individuals uh, and stay in touch in that manner. Uh, and we've gotten to the point where we never hear one another's voice, we never see anyone, and thus the real heartfelt connection between people that causes the relationship to build and grow doesn't exist. Yes, in one respect you feel uh, warmly or in a kind way towards someone, but not enough to really take action. And that's really what you're looking for, whether it's in your personal life or your professional life. You want you know, some action to occur, and it just doesn't happen without you know, the personal connection. Now, you know, I, I recognize that all of us have relationships that are all over the country now. It's impossible to do it face-to-face -face in person, but there is Skype and FaceTime and other tools that allow you to see one another and talk to one another. It makes a difference. You know, I know there are friends of mine I haven't seen in years, and you know, we'll talk, we'll Skype, and we'll do a variety of different things to stay in contact, and it is wonderful. So that's mistake number one I want to call attention to. And number two, and, and again, here I'm going to go to a, a professional level. People have unrealistic expectations, so whether it's the impact of what they do on LinkedIn or on Facebook or in person, they expect that people are going to drop everything. They, do. they don't really think this way, but they hope this way. They think they're going to drop everything that they do and go out and help them. It doesn't really work that way. Number one is if you're only communicating with people at times where you have a need rather than having a relationship, they're not really motivated to take action. And then number two, you know, even if you are doing that, people have lives that pull them in lots of different directions. Normally it takes several touches over the course of time to really get your network going. So don't be surprised if there's no instant response to you reaching out. Don't get angry, don't get pissed off, don't get annoyed, don't throw your hands up as I did before and go, ah, networking doesn't work. It does work. You just haven't been doing right and you need to correct the mistakes. Hope you found this helpful. Again, I'm Jeff Alpin, The Big Game Hunter. If you're an executive and looking for job search coaching, email me at jeffalpin at thebiggamehunter.us. Let's figure out a time to speak for a few minutes so I can see whether I can help you. I'd love to get acquainted with you. If you're not an executive, jobsearchcoachinghq.com is my site with curated information, plus the ability to ask me questions that'll help you with your search. And if it's about something broader, if your help is around your business, your life in general, your relationships, uh, again, send me an email, let me know uh, that you'd like to speak with me. We'll figure out a time to talk and I look forward to helping you. Have a great day. Take care.